Clinton County Board of Elections officials are gearing up for what they anticipate will be a busy day. Busier than a normal primary, for sure. They're expecting a large voter turnout for the New York presidential primary. That's your opportunity to say this is the, of whatever the choices we have, this is the person that I want to have represent my party in November. Clinton County Republican Commissioner Greg Campbell says it's generally a good idea to bring identification with you, especially if you're a newly registered voter. He's also reminding residents that it's a closed primary. That means voters have to be registered as a Democrat or Republican to participate. They're going to get only the ballot for the party they're registered for. SUNY Plattsburgh political science professor Harvey Shant says the New York primary is critical for candidates in both parties. It's a big prize. New York State is a big state, and no candidate has, a, as of yet, has wrapped up the number of delegates. Campbell says during the 2012 primary, there was a 9% voter turnout in Clinton County. It's a shame that for an election of that magnitude, you know, for president, that you have that few people for a primary that show up. But he thinks this time around, it will be different. It'll be considerably higher this time.